on the Gubi of Tamanju, so be one to Joe, Gubi had a more into state representative to a shy pain, you know. And I'd like to give this opportunity to our friend uh, to say a few words. We have the state representative on the 12th Assembly District, and it happened that he is here today. So we'd like to give this opportunity for him to say a couple words of it. But Jay. Thank you, Pastor. And I was inspired, even though I did not understand <laughs> what the last pastor said. But I know grace is a beautiful word. I grew up as a Lutheran. And we knew that grace was what you needed. Grace from the Christ was what you needed to get to heaven. And so I appreciate that beautiful word of grace. But I want to say this, I'm proud to be here among my Hmong friends, because like many of you, my parents were immigrants, and my grandparents were actually refugees who actually stayed in a camp for a couple of years during World War II. So I understand, I understand exactly what the Hmong community came through to get here and what values they have. And one of the values that I found that my parents had and that the Hmongs have is a need to give your children an opportunity to get a good education. I've been blessed, my wife and I have been blessed, and we set up a scholarship fund. We have a quarter million dollars in this at UWM in which we give scholarships to UWM from kids who graduate from the Milwaukee Public Schools. Much to my surprise, I was astonished how many of the kids that we've selected, and we've done this for over 10 years, and this is three or four or five scholarships every year, how many of them, almost 20% came from the Hmong community. That was to me just astonishing. That tells me that you have the same values that I have. And so we've been blessed. I hope to continue this. We've given this to the, to the university to put into a fund for long after we die. But we hope that we have many Hmongs who will go to the university. And one of the reasons my wife and I did it, my wife is a judge, and we also, by the way, helped very much uh, uh, Kashua Yang when she ran for the court, and, and was very proud to be part of her campaign that resulted in the first one elected to be a judge in the United States we are so proud of our community that did that, and I think that's very important. But we wanted to make sure that in the future, that there are among young people who hold public office and who replace me and my wife in our positions that we currently hold. Thank you so much for letting me say thank you. Thank you for the word of encouragement and also for the blessing that you have blessed our people. So may God continue to bless you and hopefully that you will come back. Our door is always open for you so you can come and join any time. Be part of the mom. And thank you. God bless you. Let's pray together. We have so many things we wanted to say. But there's so many things that we want to say is Nichimo Venaji. Come on, Nichi, I'm like that. We want to thank you. You make it happen. And we will receive. <laughs> 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 